Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Makeup by Sasha here. As part of my clear skin series, I'm going to be sharing with you my morning and nighttime skincare routine. Now, I must say guys, my skin has improved so, so much and it's only been like a month since I've been doing this routine. I've put a lot of time, effort, products into my skin as of recently since this lockdown period and I can honestly say my skin has improved like crazy like I never used to be able to leave the house without makeup on I would always have to put like a little bit of concealer or a little bit of blush or mascara to feel comfortable but I can honestly say I can leave the house like this and feel confident and it's all thanks to my new skincare routine I do have another skincare video based on what I do every single two weeks it's more like a DIY at home facial so if you guys want to see the rest of my skincare videos click on the link above I'm about to put you guys on so keep watching using my bioderma purifying cleansing foaming gel i'm just going to apply a little bit to my fingers and use that to cleanse my face i don't always like to use my clarisonic in the mornings i normally just use it in the evenings because my face can feel a little bit on the sensitive side next i'm going to take my pixie glow tonic and a cotton pad and I'm going to use that to gently exfoliate my skin. What I love about this tonic is the fact that you can actually use it day and night every single day and it's not going to irritate your skin or be too harsh on your skin. Taking the caffeine solution eye serum from The Ordinary, I'm going to apply the serum just underneath my eyes and using my two ring fingers just use that to gently massage it into my skin. With the remains of this product, I then go on to apply it to my eyelids and just around my eye area. Next, I'm taking my vitamin C serum and I'm going to use that to apply that to my skin. Guys, I absolutely love vitamin C serums. It really does give your skin a huge glow and it just brings back life to your skin. I really could not do without this. I also like to bring my serums and moisturizers down into my neck as well. Taking my Eucerin Mattifying Fluid, I'm just going to use that to apply to my skin. So this is really good, especially if I'm about to wear makeup. I like to make sure my skin is a little bit more on the matte side. I'm not really a fan of dewy skin, so this just helps to control the oils and help to prepare your skin for makeup. Next, I'm going to take my Unimi Gel Eye Mask. And if you look closely, it's got these small circular bubbles inside. It's actually best to keep it in the fridge and just use it every single morning. And yeah, it really just helps to take away the puffiness, take away the tired look. And I usually just put it on before I start my ice rolling. So with my ice roller, I usually keep it in a bag and keep it in the freezer. So it never normally comes out the freezer. And I just use that to help shrink my pores whilst I'm drinking my coffee. No time is wasted and I'm able to prep my skin for makeup or just prep my skin for the day. Ice rolling is another great deep puffer. It reduces puffiness and inflammation and it's great for under eye bags and just generally lifts the skin, closes the pores and yeah, there's just so many benefits. Last but not least, I'm taking my Carmex to condition my lips and that's the end of my morning skincare routine. Before I start my nighttime routine, I usually take off my wig using 70% rubbing alcohol. To take off my heavy makeup, I'm using the Micellar Oil Fusing Cleansing Water by Garnier. Give it a good shake and I'm just going to remove my eyelashes. Taking a cotton pad, I'm just going to gently press it onto my eyelid. So this will help to remove my eyeshadows so easily and quickly. And it's also a more delicate way of makeup removal. I much prefer to use a cleansing gel or cleansing water just to take off the majority of my makeup because it really helps to get rid of any sort of stubborn mascara traces around your eyes and it's a lot more gentle. Next I'm going to take my simple cleansing wipes to help to take off the rest of that makeup that's on my skin 
trust me guys you guys need to always double cleanse or even triple cleanse because taking off your makeup at the end of the day is like it's just as important as skincare like it goes hand in hand if you're leaving traces of makeup on the skin it's just gonna clog your pores and in turn you're just gonna get spots and your skin is just not gonna love you for that so always make sure you're taking off your makeup at the end of the day and you're doing it properly guys taking my bioderma foaming gel and my clarisonic i'm just going to squeeze about one and a half pumps and use that to further cleanse my skin you'll be surprised even after cleansing your skin twice there's still going to be makeup left on the clarisonic that's how you know you really have to deep cleanse your skin after wearing makeup so I'm just going to take my towel and pat my skin dry. Taking my Pixi Glow Tonic, I'm just going to use that to exfoliate my skin using a cleansing pad. Going in with my caffeine solution from The Ordinary, I'm just going to apply that to underneath my eyes. Using this eye serum every morning and night really does help with any sort of like under eye pigmentation or dark circles. It's definitely improved my under eyes. Taking the Balance Intense Hydration Serum, I'm just going to use that to hydrate my skin and apply it to all four points of my face. Taking my retinol serum in 0.5, absolutely love this product, I'm just going to apply it to my cheeks only, only because it's quite an oily serum guys, so I don't like to feel like my skin is just dripping with oil, so it's very 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 moisturising so I don't usually use too much of this. This product is amazing. Taking my triple active day cream from L'Oreal Paris, I'm just going to use that to apply to the four points of my face and yeah, just to moisturise my skin. So a lot of you guys always say you've got oily skin so you don't like to use moisturiser. It actually does help with the oil. Even though it says day cream, it's quite a heavy cream for the day so I like to use it at night. Next I'm taking my Carmax to condition my lips and that now i'm prepped and ready for a good night's sleep so that's it for today's video guys i hope you guys enjoyed it and i hope it was informative for you because i'm trying to put you guys on so that we can have clear skin together i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope it was informative for you you're going to have some great results if you just put the time and care into your skin like i have you're going to see some amazing results and i would love to see them so send me pictures of your results and i will be posting them up on my instagram page so if you did like this video, you guys know if you did like this video, you guys know what to do. Hit the like button and also drop a comment down below and let me know what you guys thought. If you aren't already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and click the subscribe button and click the notification bell so you know when I'm next posting. But until then, I'll see you guys again in my next video. Take care. Bye.